Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Jade Falcon Freeborn. So we took some major hits yesterday. Griff got hit in the head and got knocked out for 71 days, well 93 days, it's down to 71 now. Uh, and we lost blockade. Once again, Goss rifle shot to the head and that was over. So not much we can really do about that. So we're down two of our most experienced pilots. El Duce died a few, few episodes back and blockade went down and now Griff's out of action. So Mockingbird's really the only most is the most experienced pilot left. So she's going to be leading the lances for the next little bit, um, at least until Griff is Griff is back. So a couple things. Um, first of all, we jump back to Ironhold. Uh, I want to pull a few missions off here. It's only an eight-day jump, so I figure we just jump over here, uh, refresh mid the missions, and see what we can get to. Uh, um, basically, uh, get some more gear, get some more sea bills. So you notice our sea bills have gone way up. I went in, if we go to uh, the store real quick, I sold a bunch of the older mechs that we had. We've got a ton of mechs, like tons of mechs. Um, so I went through and basically sold, with the exception of the Gorilla uh, and the Strix and the Thunderbolt, I sold basically all the Intersphere versions of all the mechs we had. Um, plus like things like the Firestarter 2C, the Jenner 2C, things like that. Mechs that we're never going to go back to. Um, cause we needed money for a couple of things. One, as soon as I jumped back here, um, there was a rack five plus in the store. So I picked it up. Um, so if we go to the mech bays real quick, made a couple of minor adjustments to the mechs. Timberwolf C, um, I was, I was able to buy a heat bank in the store, a clan heat bank. So I threw it in here, which helps a little bit more with the heating. Um, Tinderwolf night gear basically has the same, uh, gear back in the head again. So, um, yeah, uh, the only problem is, is we don't have the uh, indirect fire uh, fire control system. So I put the Rainmaker system in. Um, that's the only thing that I have that's for missile. So it's minus 15% of heat generated. So this guy's going to be really heat efficient. Um, range sensors uh, increased the range bracket by 10% just because there was a couple of times where our LRMs weren't hitting. So hopefully this will help out a little bit. And then enhanced imaging. Um, of course, for the better chance to hit and recoil reduction and things like that. So, yeah, that's that. Um, now let's have a look at, uh, yeah, the Orion. So basically, let's have a just quick look here. So we know we've split up the ammo on both sides. We put a double load of Rack 5, which I was able to buy in the store in here. Uh, adding, the, adding the clan rotary autocannon gave us an extra ton. So I was able to fit a laser AMS in here. Um, so it's beginning, starting the beginning of basically getting AMSs and stuff on all my mechs. I thought about putting a tag, but I think the defense is probably a little bit better. Um, usually because the Griff is piloting this, it's a little bit better chance to hit. Also, I pulled out a double heat sink and put an E-Cooling plus one in, which I had lying around. I'm not sure why I did that, and I said I put an E-Cooling plus one, but just save a couple spaces here. So that's basically all that was done with the Orion. All right. So let's have a look at some mechs or the, some uh, contracts here. The Mjolnir and the Catapult are both finished repairing, but I haven't done anything to them yet. Not sure if, if I'm planning on using them or bringing other mechs forward yet. Just going to let them sit for a bit. Uh, we're already at nine and a half million sea bills per month. We got to hire some new pilots. Um, we've lost two already. We're going to need to get some more pilots in. So got to figure out how we're going to do that too. So um, I'm thinking here, let's just start off with something relatively simple, like hard contact. Um, it's basically attacking a pirate force uh, to battle. So let's just do this. Just to get kind of back into the swing of things here with the lance. And we'll go full salvage on it because we've got plenty. All right, so six pack. Let's bring uh, Mockingbird up. Um, Six pack and, and Sundance will be here and here. And it looks like it's going to be Rhino. Thought about bringing Hannibal in, but um, she's got Juggernaut instead of uh, Fire Maneuver. And I think um, Rhino needs more experience. Um, Avalanche, which again has got uh, Juggernaut as well, which is not really doing anything for us. Um, so let's bring Rhino in to get some experience. All right, so let's deploy and do this. All right, let's do this. I know we're coming. 
We know we're coming. Let's just do this. All right, so this is the Easter episode of Jade Falcon Freeborn. So once again, I know I said it a couple days ago, but uh, or a day ago or so, but uh, happy Easter to everybody. Um, I'm not particularly religious, so I don't really, you know, celebrate Easter at all. But uh, we do get together as a family. So I'm recording two episodes of Jade Falcon Freeborn. It's Saturday night for me, so I'm going to get a couple of these um, done. So I'm not going to have time to record an episode tomorrow. But I want to have episodes for Monday for everybody, so I'm going to do two in a row here just so that we've got them. What do we got here? Fire truck, okay. Um, Good to go. Yeah, so that's what I'm working on Heading out. for today. And um, yeah, I don't really have a large family. I mean, my side of the family, my, my both my parents have, have uh, passed away and my brother's gone. Um, so it's just uh, me, except with the exception of my, my nephew. Uh, my brother's son. Um, let's just fire at this guy. Um, but he's got, you know, his, his mother's side of the family. Plus, he's married too now. So, you know, he's got uh, his wife's family as well. So, I won't be seeing him over the holiday or over the Easter break, but that's fine. Um, but yeah, so I'll be getting together with my wife's family mostly. So, yeah. That's my Easter, but I hope everybody else's Easter is good. I like I like it just because it just gives an ex another excuse for family to get together and hang out. Of course we do, but where are they? Back there? I'm guessing. That's the second lance there. What do we got here? Hoplite. Okay. Alright. Let's start on this. You get to enjoy the... Oh, I forgot to change out the ER medium. Ah. Dumbass. Let's just go back to three. Just conserve a bit of ammo. We've got 94 rounds. It's not too bad, I guess. A couple hits. Nice. Receiving you. Oh, there we go. Four ELRGs. Firing away. Only you can start forest fires. Systems holding. Is that Ebola? Yeah, Ebola's coming in as well. Commander. That's that fire truck. Um, sure. Wow. <laughs> I still love that explosion. It's so awesome. It's so awesome. Okay, Spectre. Gotta move up this hill. Not gonna let them have high ground if we can avoid it. Yes, Commander. I copy. Alright, what else do we got here? Catapult. Light TBM and a heavy TBM carrier, eh? That's not friggin' good. Bola Dominus. Rottweiler, okay. I was hoping. That we weren't gonna oh. it. We weren't gonna be facing mostly vehicles, but unfortunately, it's just kind of how it's working out. Let's go to four. Put some damage on this guy. Okay, not bad. Five hits. That's the big threat, really. Locking in all weapon systems. She's really not the best at targeting, but that's fine. Yep. 
Yeah, the AMS system's working out. That's awesome. I'm noticing more and more now there's like a lot of mechs got AMS systems built in. Oh, you want to have an artillery duel, eh? We can do that. My artillery is bigger than your artillery. Light damage. It's go time. <laughs> it's go time. Sky moving first, maybe? Spectre? God, it's really hard to get eyes on these guys, eh? Want this rot while they're gone. Taking the shot. Okay, not bad. Waiting for orders. So I'm thinking that um, Got it. when we do the re re replacements for uh, the mainlands. I'm going to keep the secondary lands intact, I think. Reporting. Enemy vehicle eliminated. So Six Pack and Sundance will, rem will remain in the second lands. Sorry. Um, six Pack, yeah, Six Pack Rhino and Sundance will all be in the second lands. Waiting for orders. What is up, guy? What is up? Play the long range game, we can do that. I copy. We can definitely do that. Ready for orders. Roger. Huh. Do we go after the Ebola? We can do more damage. Yeah, let's warlord it and go after the Ebola. Firing. I think we should be able to kill it this turn, I hope. Orders. Not sure what that guy was up to. Forty-three, huh? All we gotta do is hit the front. The shot. Or we could just shoot up the side too. That works. Spread it around. Receiving. Oh, did we destroy that guy? Firing a full salvo. I didn't think we destroyed him. He must have just vanished off our sensors. Alright, let's split this up. We're going to try and kill this vehicle. Whoa, really? Well, Hoplite's taking a punishment anyway. They've got a sensor lock on me. That catapult must be the one with the uh, 
PPCs on it or something, or Gauss rifles. Oh. Standing by. This guy taking a lot of damage everywhere. All right, let's um. I'll pee this guy's torso here, see if we can take it. Inflicted some heavy damage. Location confirmed. Hmm. Interesting. I'm going to do this and this. Eh, maybe not. Hoplite? Probably. Damage. Well, probably a bit of damage anyway. A little bit unstable. Waiting for orders. Rolling. All right, let's grind him up. Enemy eliminated. Order. Ah, you gave me your back. Wow, PPC and a lot of rocket launchers. Something got damaged. I think I hit something good. I think you did too. Almost seems like kind of a waste to load up all those rocket launchers on a catapult. But the bonus about it is like it got a lot of missile well, that thing is still alive. Got a lot of missile hard points. See if we can finish this guy off. Affirmative. Nice. One more for the trash. Waiting for orders. Double time. Let's go. Let's make sure this guy goes away. Oh, really? Target's taking a critical hit. Man, that should have been a kill. Uh-huh. 29 points damage, huh? I'm gonna pay for that. Commander? No, really, no, really you are. I'm gonna send you the bill in the mail. Huh, can't get to that catapult. Can't get to that specter though. Just barely. Ooh, a couple hits though. It's kinda good. Setting him up for this guy. But this guy's not going to be here to do anything. Roger. There we go. Goodbye. Okay. Not much left. Catapult still hasn't fired yet. Good to go. Position confirmed. Huh. 
Huh, same on both legs, eh? Let's go after one leg then. Well, okay, we got two hits on it. Ow. What? Commander. Location you took your back shot, now you're gonna give me one too? Wow, really bad chance to hit though. Firing. Oh, four misses, really? That's a miss. Yeah, man, I saw that. I should have taken the leg. Critical hit, Commander. You bet it was. Yep, went down. All right, not sure who Rhino's gonna shoot for. Might go after this guy. We can get a direct line of sight in the catapult, though. Double time. Let's go after the other leg. Because why not? Full on enemy. Still got to get up and do something here. Let's see what he does. Still hasn't fired. Only got a back shot on him, huh? Nope. On it. Let's see how you like this. That looked like two leg hits there. Target's taking a critical hit. Again. Commander. Okay, get this side from here. Should be able to take that leg. Yep. Mech destroyed. Thank you. Thank God he's only got a couple of those on there. All right, fire on his back. Wow, only one hit. Really? Maybe we can kill this guy. And when the smoke clears, he's gone. Oh, Spectre's going first. Oh, come on, buddy. Really? Mealing again? Yes, Commander. There we go. Side attack. Might be able to get some good gack off these guys. See how it goes here. Firing all the oh, really? Critical hit, Commander. Standing by. Standing by. I 
I'll just go after the leg, why not? Well, Enemy down. just as good. Mission successful. All right, 75,000. So that should cover our repairs, I think. Let's see what we got here. Well, we got four items we can take. Well, we could take three Spectre parts and sell it. Eh. Um... Anything worth it? Two eighty core. Fire control system indirect. Okay, we lost one of those, so let's take that back. So that could be used in the night gear. Double heat sink kit's worth how much? Two and a half million. Let's take that. NSS. We still got a bunch of these, don't we? We've got two left. Upper energy, let's take that. Ammo wise, thunderbolts, no. Fluid, AC5, safe ammo, no. NSS is worth how much? 600. Not that much. This will give me 325,000. So let's go that right. We got a couple things we can sell. We didn't really make that much off of this. We did replace a couple things, which are nice. All right, let's let's confirm this. A few Mac parts. Oh, we almost got a Spectre. Some rocket launchers. Nah. Indo steel. Man, not nah. Kind of crappy. All right. Bunch of stuff happening there. So sixty thousand in repairs. Not too bad. Four days, we should get those back, no problem. All right, let's get those back. I want to make a couple minor adjustments to the mechs. Okay. Sorry, I want the pilots back yet. Uh, let's get the mechs back. So, um, we'll see. We lost. Yeah. So let's refit this guy. We lost the weapon mounts on this guy, unfortunately. So what we can do, go to equipment. We can find the upper arm energy here. We could throw that in. That'll help out with a bit of accuracy. Ooh, it's one ton, is it? It's one ton, is it? Well, well, double heat sink, probably. Go for more accuracy. Uh, well, maybe not. Yeah, maybe not. But I stay a little cooler, I think. And then let's have a look at the night gear. So we want to replace that uh, Rainmaker. It's keeping us running really, really heat efficient. Well, fairly heat efficient. Pull it out. It's still heat efficiency drops, but it doesn't show it, which is interesting. Uh, but what we want to do is we want to go down and grab the indirect one, plus three, because we're doing a lot of indirect firing with this guy. You can really notice the difference in the last mission there. All right, get this guy repaired. So I am going to end the episode here. I know it's a short episode today, but I'm going to end the episode here. You guys have a great Easter. Enjoy the time with your family, um, if that's what you're doing. Um, yeah. So if you like the episode, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe and put any comments in the comment section down below. And until next time, we'll see you later.